Hi everybody, I'm Elizabeth Larson, otherwise known as Beth Larson, and I am delighted and excited to have a photography show at Misty River Arts Gallery. Um, started January 14th and it's February 6th. Um, I have a selection of my photographs um, printed and, and ready for you to come and see. Hope you all come. Um, uh, uh, many of them are from the area. I've been um, very fortunate to be able to experience the landscapes and the events, the people in this area, and uh, have had a lot of fun taking pictures of things. And, and uh, also appreciate very much the patience of people around here who put up with me and my camera. So, um, I take pictures of whatever I come across. And, and sometimes it's farm animals, had some lovely tours at local farms, and obviously the animals pose just as people do, and they didn't seem too self-conscious. Um, next uh, are images from the Rodeo and the Kispe Ox Valley Music Festival, uh, two much-loved events in our area that I've spent lots of time and, and taken lots of shots of. Um, these are just a very small selection of the thousands of photos that I have. It was hard to decide. Um, well, this one wasn't hard to decide, actually. This one we call Cowboy Gravity. Um, and uh, just, just love the, the expressions um, and that moment with the, with the flying cowboy. Um, yeah, and, and uh, festival is, is always just so, so wonderful in terms of color and sound and, and engagement and um, we like to have musicians, but, yes, musicians, we like to have musicians at festival, but magicians, um, this, this magician is Josiah Class and as you can tell, um, quite a lot of delight and interest in what he was doing. Um, and uh, sometimes it's beautiful weather, sometimes it's, it's rainy and we have puddles to splash in, and anything that happens is a go when it comes to Kiss the Ox Music Festival. Um, this is Elijah, so I have a little shot of him with his guitar, at, although that wasn't at festival. Um, taking pictures of musicians wherever they're playing is, is always uh, a challenge, and i um, been very happy that these, these musicians were willing to have me have their pictures in the show. Um, and uh, there's some other events from the Hazeltons. This is from the breath of our grandmother's event that happened a number of years ago. Beautiful women and children um, engaged with each other. It's really poignant to be able to look at, at the proximity and the, the openness that we have had in the past that we don't have now and look forward to again, to be able to breathe together. Um, Many nights this summer, there were um, drummers and supporters of the healthcare workers in the Hazeltons. Uh, this is Ray Harris, um, who came to many of those events. Um, and uh, pictures of festival would be not complete without um, acknowledging the little ones that are there. There's always a lot of um, romping and rolling down hills and um, delight. So there's, there's one of our local kids. Moving on, uh, the section that's coming up next is uh, mostly the travel photo and um, I've been very fortunate to travel to Cuba. The pictures here are, are from uh, a couple of different trips to Cuba. Um, these pictures anyway, I should say. Um, this is a, a mountain slide in Alberta, and um, by Anch. So, so as you can see, um, it could be light and color, could be a moment of connection, it could be some a juxtaposition of something that you'd never expect to see, like a cat asleep inside a library by a sign. Um, and uh, with some double exposure there, some reflection. Um, so just those are those are moments that photographers go, oh, there's there's something cool. Um, 
And I, I should also uh, say that uh, I very, I'm very grateful to the editing process that we have access to these days uh, because it's another whole playground for photography. So um, uh, I think that's all about that. Um, another wonderful moment was uh, coming back from shooting a wedding this summer and uh, being at the Witsat Canyon and uh, finding fishing happening and being able to just, just capture a fish in a net uh, along with the fishermen. Uh, Hymux is an event, a uh, harvest event that happens every year in Kitsugukla. These are the Kitamas dancers um, and they warm up in the hallway and then go into the hall and that was a moment of preparation. Always an honor to be at, at uh, events such as Hymux. Uh, we have a we have a great garden at our house, and here here are some of the flowers uh, that we enjoy every summer. This is uh, the West's field, very close to our home as well. And uh, you may find that this photo is on some shower curtains at a home near you, because apparently there were a whole bunch of them that were ordered. So, um, uh, but it it illustrates both um, the natural growing flora, the fireweed, the, the farming that goes on, and, and the wilderness in behind. So one of the things I love about photography the most is that it's about moments. And uh, even when it comes to uh, landscapes, like mountains and, and lakes and rivers and, and trees, the light can be different. The, the, the humidity in the air, the, the precipitation, the, um, the moment in time um, is unique. And, and this wall um, demonstrates that for me. Um, of course, this is a, this is a fall scene um, with, a, with a segment of stick yodin. Um, doesn't always look like, doesn't always look like that with those grasses. This was a, a, a scene that I found out about um, by chance when I, was, when I was at the Hazel Branch and I went running to catch the rainbow. And we all know that rainbows don't last too long, but they indicate that there's something very valuable and, and uh, Hazelton is that for me. Um, sometimes it's a, it's a climate thing. And this, this was the Balkley River in 2018 that was um, incredibly low and, and uh, uh, provided a, a stunning moment of, of no water where there is usually much water. Um, um, the, a moment in springtime, um, just after a rain. An early morning walk with dogs. This one is from Vancouver, from Trout Lake, uh, and and uh, shadows and light are often what make a photograph. Um, this is Ross Lake in the summertime. I was taking photos with some very dear friends who are also avid photographers, and uh, we have a little group, a group of women who are um, experiencing the joys of photography together. And um, the, the, the mist, or the, the smoke is from a, a fire that a dad and his girls were having. Um, and so, so every, every photograph in the show means something to me because it was a moment, because it was um, being there and uh, experiencing that moment through the camera as something um, special, sometimes sacred. Sometimes it's just an off chance, and there's, um, believe me, there's, there's many photographs not represented here that may look something like, but not be quite, quite the one that I chose. Um, because photography's like that, and digital photography's like that. You can, you can take a lot of photos. So um, I, I hope that you enjoy what you, what you see here, and um, that's what I want to capture with my photographs is, is joy.
and and really, as I said in my artist bio, um, it's really about love. It's about loving life and loving um, what it what it brings. So, thanks for listening, and hope you enjoy the show.